But since we live in the future, we don't even need a gun to train. Well, technically, technically that's a gun. So let's play some video games. We we'll also try to monitor Giga's heart, so uh, his normal BPM right now is around 84, 83, 85. So we will see if he also gets his adrenaline up with the shooting. So right now, I uh, in the game, I don't have the gun in my hand. The gun is on my hip, um, but this is the controller and with this I can grab the gun. So I have to put my hands into the starting position here. Now I grab my gun with this button and I go shoot. In the middle I can also reload. And when I'm finished, if you are finished. end stage and I have to unload the gun, so magazine out, Hammer down. and in the poster. <laughs> so it's... Um, it's made like a shooting competition, like IPSEC or USPC USPCA. Um, so yeah, you can actually train with it. How is my heart rate right now? My heart rate not right now is 104. <laughs> how do you implement the recoil? Do you know what I mean? So how... Yeah, well, you have no recoil here. Only trigger control. I don't know. I, I think it still helps because it helps with your movement you get the feeling of of doing a stage despite not shooting so everything else is very similar um, of course you don't have recoil but uh, the computer is calculating where you are aiming when you're pressing the trigger and you'll be surprised even without recoil how much you are moving the gun just pressing the trigger so the recoil for me at least is not that important factor but i think anyone could really really benefit from this kind of training even just beginners with what you can benefit i don't know with everything you, you get right now i have a feeling that i'm really standing in in a 3d space in front of me there are targets the the, the distance is actual distance i would say maybe six meters to that target if i move closer to the target it becomes bigger, it's, it's really realistic. And uh, if not anything else, I'm using the sights in the game. So I, I am um, practicing target, target acquisition. And also if you're really meshing this trigger on the controller, you are not getting all the shots off. Um, you actually have to control the trigger finger properly to, f to shoot fast here. With the combination of dry fire, uh, Manti sex system and this, you're basically at 95% of everything that you need. What kind of sex system? <laughs> <laughs> Mantis X, yeah, I got you. Yeah. Um, Did you say sex? Mantis <laughs> sex system. Mantis no, I, I think this is really, really, really good way of training. If not anything else, even if you're not just considering shooting, but how the stage is set and how you have to, you know, shoot around the obstacles or you can plan your stage where to start, which target to shoot first. How is 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 that is the adrenaline similar to what you have while you're shooting? You know what I mean. Just before the beeper goes off, you kind of feel like, woo. Yeah, I, I would say that not the same as shooting, uh, especially not the same as if I would be in a in a competition. Because in a real competition, it's not just guns, but it's also added um, stress from from you know the range officer, from people watching you you trying to perform so i would say that's like high up then you have shooting here and then just under shooting we have this
Fuck. Oh, oh dobre, dobre. Shit. <laughs> so is VR the next best thing for training? I don't think so, but it's a very fun way of improving your skills. Especially now with the ammo prices, you can have fun at home, you know, play games, also do some training and it will improve your skills. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe you sukabliat. <laughs> fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Run through the court and score. Fuck off. First try to fuck off. Fuck fuck off.